I have never in my 30 years of living seen somebody lose a battle to ants before, before Katie attempted to try to kill these ants. What did she, she do? lost to the ants. They took back the raid canister from her and she could not use it anymore. <laughs> she had to abandon ship. She just left. She just left the kitchen. Oh, no. <laughs> she just could not, could not do it. Gaggle yeah. idiots. <laughs> 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 well, that, I hope that made okay, the cut. Okay, it's yeah. T minus like s five, six days for a move in. I'm moving into like this very Hostile toxic home. Home. <laughs> environment it already. Toxic. What's the most toxic home you've ever lived in? This about, one. About to be this one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I can tell you from experience, a whole year I've lived here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. You're getting white hair. So <laughs> damn, you can't even yeah. tell. I know. I it's, can. Okay. Yeah, she's toxic, <laughs> as I was saying. So. <laughs> Jesus. All right, Katie, hit us with the intro. I don't know what the intro is. Okay, what is up? <laughs> Welcome to the Toxic Podcast. As always, Katie, Jose, Danny, how are you guys doing? Oh, Great, good, good, fantastic, good. phenomenal, yeah. spectacular, yeah. amazing. Mm -hmm. Oh, love that. Love that. Not toxic, I'm hoping. Uh, everything's good in the hood. Yep. Yep. Yeah. 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 Yeah, Kate. my my dad just came down uh, from Texas. He drove down here to attend my niece's birthday party. Yeah, oh, can sweet. we get? You can say no to this. Can we get a cult update twenty twenty two? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Again, the yeah, podcast so, last time was funny. Okay. So as of right now, I, before I told you guys that he thought the world was going to end in twenty twenty three. Yeah. Yeah. But now they moved the goalposts. So ah, now it's twenty twenty five. Was it because twenty twenty three was too close? Like there's like oh shit, or well, like. There's only a few months left. <laughs> like it's not looking too good. I guess. Yeah, yeah. 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 So uh, he's still in that cult. You know, okay. he still uh -huh. thinks the world's gonna end. Uh, but get this: it's how he thinks it's gonna end is like the Earth is gonna reverse its rotation, and mm. it's gonna sink into the sun, and then we're all gonna go to hell, uh, except for the people who are part of the cult and meditate. But wouldn't you get so bored oh. seeing the same, like, 30 people all the time? Like, mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know. And he was saying, like, oh, like, you come with me, you know, when the world ends and uh, we'll be reincarnated. You know, we'll live for 55,000 years. So is he offering you to come back to Texas or is he saying by him meditating, he's securing you a spot? Yeah, that's wow. what he's saying. He's securing okay. you a spot. That's what he's saying. Hey, like, so yeah. I, yeah. Get, I, so you I can guess do whatever I got to pass. You can do whatever you want yeah. now. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You ain't okay. going to hell, bud. Yeah. Although I, I have seen the reversing the earth on a Superman movie, and it just makes the world go back in time is what it yeah, actually does. I so they've got that all fucked up. <laughs> so it doesn't go into the sun. It reverses they're the time. They're on to something. Yeah. They're, just, they're just not aware. Yeah. 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 Just a little bit. Uh, somebody watched so the wrong. You're telling me that if we all run in one direction, we might be able to change the earth's rotation? That I don't know. All right. <laughs> that I don't know. <laughs> it's like, this cold sounds pretty good. It's like <laughs> Sorry, guys. I'm quitting. Uh, I don't know how the Earth is going to, you know, reverse its yeah. rotation. It's the magnetic polarities, you know. <laughs> I was on board with him mm -hmm. when he was saying, like, yeah, Russia is going to just launch its nukes. Okay. And then everyone else is going to launch its nukes. I'm like, okay, that's plausible. It's yeah, like the old I, animated, you know. Yeah. Yeah. And, I'm, and I was like, I can see that. But then he went into, like, oh, there's going to, like, reverse the rotation. I'm like, ah, you lost me right there. Okay. Okay. So, does he openly talk about it with you, though? Like, Yes. I was in the mall, South Coast, and Bloomingdale's. <laughs> yeah. We, we uh, saw your mom buying stuff. Yeah, the bougie Louis Vuitton purse. Two, Two of, of them. them. <laughs> Damn. I was in there. I saw it from your sister's perspective, too. I was like, what the fuck? They just walked in, and they were like, yeah, let's look around and, and shit. And then... My mom saw like a uh, purse that she liked, and yeah. she's like, "I don't, know, I want that one. I want to buy that." Okay, oh. so I have a question because last I've heard in the Danny history books, their job was a gas station slash nail salon. Gas station only. Gas station only. Yeah, mm -hmm. but it was was there some sort of nail salon fashion? Okay, no. Gas station only. What are they doing now for money? Where they can afford that? They're not doing anything for money. They're just. Living off of uh, the money they made from the gas station, selling the house, okay, and selling the gas station. So I think they have like a mill or two, just chilling. So they're just on. living yeah. life right now. Well, if they have a mill or two, and the only thing they're going to be around for three years, like that's, that's why she's buying like, those purses. Chilling. Yeah, that's why. Okay, my dad was offering like, "Do you want like a Rolex? Do you want a watch?" And I'm like, "Whoa, what the fuck?" I would have been like, "Fuck Danny? yeah, dog!" I would have been mm -hmm. like, "I'll like, take that." He wanted to buy me some like Louis Vuitton like belts and stuff. Hey, like, bro, sell that hey, shit, hey, bro, bro, bro. Mm -hmm. I don't want to become a target. Bro, you know, bro, bro, true. Megan works there. She gives you discounts. Megan? Megan. Nice. Dog, I would have accepted everything. Well, I mean, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> Anna, you asked, you know, her discounts. She ran out of it, didn't she? Or is that what she says? I have no idea. Know? 
I ha- I have to actually get back to her. Mm-hmm. I will definitely I, de- I will definitely be like. So uh, do I get a discount, Megan? Hmm? Hmm? I feel or like you Megan out? just said that because like on it. I think it was just know? too was, soon was for her, and well, it was you like, don't want to give everybody out your discount. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, that's like yeah. yeah. God damn it! I'm a and she's kind of a stranger to Megan. Yeah. You know? yeah. So you don't want to be doing that. <laughs> she probably got scared and was like, "Oh fuck, I've, I've said too much." So he offered you belts and Rolexes, and you were like, "Nah, I'm good, dog." Yeah. Dude, those belts go for like yeah. what the cheapest ones, like three hundred dollars. Better person than I am. I'm like, yeah, I take I can take that six grand one. Thank you. <laughs> Sam would resell the Rolex Dude, right instantly. away. Yeah. I'd be walking by that store the next day. I'd be like, yeah, I yeah. can't do that. I can't do that. I like to then your pops cash. comes back next month, be like, son, where's your Rolex? Oh yeah, it got stolen. It got Sorry. stolen. <laughs> it just hurts my wrist. So it's, <laughs> it's, it's like, too heavy, Dad. <laughs> it's a display piece at home now. <laughs> <laughs> you just have the trust is there. They're gonna be here until like the end of the month. Oh, really? They're over here that long? Where yeah, are they staying at? Karen uh, is staying with my cousin, and my dad and mom are staying at a hotel. So, what is the update on your sister, Karen? Is she still chilling, or is she still like wanting to get the fuck out of there? She still wants to get the fuck out of there. Uh-huh. Like she's, you know, smart enough to know like my dad's talking bullshit. You know, yeah. it's just crazy, crazy yeah. talk, and. She hears him talk to it about like everybody, every oh, single yeah, person shit. he can yeah. get a hold of. He'll talk That's to about the other world. They, how did they get your dad though? Like, dude, I don't know. Like, I remember the, the it's YouTube or, videos. Remember well, YouTube the, videos? Was it really YouTube mm-hmm. videos? Yeah, it's a YouTube cult. I don't know how like he first got introduced, but YouTube ruins it, lives. It did way. go to the yeah. YouTube videos. Oh, like, okay. Because I remember yeah. from the original podcast, it was you saying, "I don't know how my dad got on here except for watching videos." And I was like, "What the fuck?" Yeah. But yep. how does Andy feel about it? Same as me. Same. Yeah. So I'm just saying now is the perfect time to kidnap Karen. How old is she? 15. Damn, Damn. time flies by. Holy. Almost time. Fruit's almost ripe. (laughs) (laughs) I hate that. (laughs) (laughs) You see her face go to disgust. (laughs) Jesus. Well, not like that, you know. Yo, wow, okay. that's what it sounded like. <laughs> Are you gonna have her live up in one of these uh, future vacant rooms? Could Ryan's room right here? Could. Yeah, mm-hmm. bada bing, bada boom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Or the multiple will be open or the one soon. right above us. Or multiple openings soon? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't know. Don't listen to her. She's toxic. So. <laughs> she likes turning up shit. See, so. not true. Mm-hmm. Uh, so. In our life, we've had a massive ant infestation that's been going on here. Kind of like a cult, but a cult that lives inside the walls of our house. So <laughs> it's, li- uh, it's like, uh, what is it? Uh, I was just watching Harry Potter yesterday. The the Chamber of Secrets somewhere down mm-hmm. here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Our house is the Chamber of Secrets. They are literally coming from inside the walls of the house. Like, they're not, like, crawling up the outside of the house. Mm-hmm. They're getting inside the walls somehow and then coming up through the inside of the, the wall. The house is so old, there's cracks in it. Yeah. And so that's where they're coming from. Have you guys an uh, exterminator or anything like well, that? Any thoughts? We we've had we have a couple of capable hands here. Uh, so Josh, n- no. So I in our room we had it really bad, and then we b- we bought some like sealant stuff. So mm-hmm. we kind of like we sealed. killed them, seal up the thing, and then I bought ant traps like that are supposed to like take back to work. their queen and like kill them. And then I yeah, bought yeah. ant spray that smells like lavender. So I ah. got the best of both worlds. And I've been wanting to put the traps out, but I've never been able to find, like, a good enough. Like, the one time they were in our uh, living room, somebody here was having an absolute meltdown, so I just killed them really quick. Don't know who that we don't, We're not going to point <laughs> yeah, anybody yeah, out who this possibly <laughs> They're having a meltdown, so I just killed them really quick. And Damn I, like, it, Danny. Them away. Yeah. Uh-huh. yeah. <laughs> so, and then I've been waiting. Like, I've been trying to put these traps out, but they're liquid-based. So I don't, which I don't think is the best option. They had two. One said liquid on it. I don't know what the other thing was, but I bought the liquid because the liquid one was like specifically it kills the colony and the queen. I was like, hell yeah, I'm gonna get that one. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna, uh, he's gonna make that one amp be like, oh god. But I like, got this I keep putting thing. them out when I see like four or five of them. I'm like, oh, they're like, they're like checking it out. I just need like one sleeper cell to go in there, you know? <laughs> and it just never does anything. It never seems to do anything. So I've been waiting for like the the the, the massive colony to come in through a second time. So we finally had it happen. And a lot of times, because they're liquid based, they dry out. So we finally had it happen. And I was dying laughing. Slash, I was checking on somebody in the house. I was also having a meltdown. Um, we had the kitchen just infested with ants. Just Ooh. like so many ants. And I guess it was right after you left one time. Mm-hmm. And, <laughs> and left you to die. I know. There was such a funny text chain happening. I was dying at work. It was so funny. I was not laughing. <laughs> <laughs> I have never in my 30 years of living 
seen somebody lose a battle to ants before before Katie attempted to try to kill these ants. What did she, she do? She lost to the ants. They took back the raid canister from her and she could not use it anymore. <laughs> she had to abandon ship. She just left she just left the kitchen. Oh no. <laughs> she just could not could not do it. Just, what did they all I like wish I could see they my were everywhere. Did they like combine it. and create an arm and just move it well, all? I was having, you know, I had the raid. I was told I had to help because I told them I wanted to just go upstairs and leave it to be someone else's problem, which I got yelled at and I could not do that. So I started spraying them. But like every once in a while, I'd set the raid down and like look at something else to see if they were. I kept spraying them. But then they started like crawling all over the raids. I can't touch that because they're going to touch me. So? They were everywhere. I don't want to be touched. <laughs> and then, do you feel them like on yes. you right now? Like that little. And then right I get now. a message from her. Text message: Will I die if I got raid in my mouth? <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, how? You did not eat raid. Like, how did you get raid? And I get no response, so I have to stop working once again because of somebody else's house. So I have to step away for a second. My, they must think I live with just absolute idiots at my work. I'm just like, I'm sorry. I have what to do you tell about work? You're like, sorry. I my just showed them the text message. I need to step out for a second. Like, I'm just sorry. And they're like, oh, okay, Sam, it's all good. So I step out for a second, like, you okay? And she's sobbing. Like, <laughs> she's in the shower sobbing. Just like, and she's like, it's just, and I'm like, how did you, did you seriously? Well, I was shooting the rain and some of it rained down into my mouth. Why are you shooting like, it up? And I, and I, everywhere. <laughs> and I'm like, no I ha- I'm like, I have to ask a question because you know, it can come out in like a spray. Like it's supposed to like yeah. a miss it. But if you don't like shake it or like hold it in the right angle, it shoots out like a solid stream. Like, a, and I'm like, what was it doing? This stream? It was the stream. It was everywhere. <laughs> and I'm like, you didn't shake it. Nobody said I had to. That <laughs> says so the, the fucking the can. fucking the kitchen was probably just drenched in rain. If she was just shooting the liquid, it was probably drenched. Oh you God. need to ask Josh. He was the one who had to clean it up. <laughs> <laughs> and then she was. She is like taking a shower, and then she has another meltdown. She, she's just like there's ants in the shower. It's like just spray them down, just spray them down. And then she is convinced that one of them purposefully lodged itself inside of her shaving gel. So when she pressed no. down on the shaving gel, it shot itself out of her. No. And she just started bawling. Just started bawling. They're attacking me. They're in the shower gel. Just like, why is it there? Like, and she's just saying this through tears oh of just these ants are plotting against her. And they're just like, they specifically got himself positioned to attack. They sold back the raid bottle. They're all oh over my the God. These ants are your nemesis, huh? I know, and I was home alone, and you left me to die, Danny. You didn't flag me down. I didn't see them until it was too late. <laughs> they were everywhere, and they're crying up the walls, and they're behind the kitchen cabinets, and they're all in the dishes. And then somebody left a bowl full of frosting in the sink. It was covered. I couldn't even see the white anymore from the frosting. It was all black from the ants. That's gross. I know. Uh, why don't you drown them? I did. That's how the date started. In raid, Jose. In raid, <laughs> she shot a solid stream of raid. Damn it! Uh, you know, don't don't make any cookies or anything like that. Dude, You're gonna have deja vu all over again. To be fair, and then I get like all I'm seeing from the mess- messenger is Josh raging because like they just went to Costco and bought like big ass things of muffins and stuff, yeah. and they're all over the muffins. Oh <laughs> like, my god! It's like what is like. Katie, you didn't shoot the raid in there. I did. <laughs> I did. I did. <laughs> like, if she's shooting the liquid, it's just done. The whole, the whole are just done. Well, aren't you glad you didn't move in yet? <laughs> he should. Maybe I could have helped out. Yeah. Maybe it yeah. would you could have saved this, her. You know, that or the can would have been taken mess. away from both of them. Jesus. But I was dealing with that for what felt like an eternity. I'm like, okay, I'm going to cool off. I'm going to take a shower. And they were all over the shower. And then, okay, I sprayed them down. I thought I was done with. And I went to go, like, pump my uh, shaving gel. So I did, like, a little test pump just to make sure. Because, you know, the end gets, like, sticky. Yeah. So I went, and there's a bug in there. It shot me in the neck. <laughs> this I one's like, I'm going to kill her, guys. Then, like, I had to, like, rinse it off in the shower. And it was just, like, sliding <laughs> down my naked body. It was horrible. <laughs> And she got touched by a fucking ant. It it harassed me. Yes, yeah, so there's a lot of drama moving into the past. Yeah. <laughs> Are you prepared for the random screaming? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, I used to live with Tommy, so. Uh, <laughs> You're 100% correct. I totally yeah, forgot about that. And I'm used to it. 
I mean, I don't think you've ever seen somebody lose to ants before. So I have not. Yeah, I have not. I've seen someone lose. I mean, to me stairs. and Tommy were capable enough to, you know, <laughs> yeah. handle. Yeah, so it's a man. I problem. kept trying to tell him to use the the ant Bro, trap. there's an ant on me. <laughs> oh my god, there I is. I see it. They're Look at there's one on They're him. Plotting. Yeah. They heard you. It's like Beetlejuice. <laughs> Sorry, this Danny. This is the scout, bro. Yep. This is a scout. Kill and it, Danny. Danny's just watching it crawl up him. He's going to gonna become like the, the dude from Naruto. What's his face? Now flick it at Katie. Flick <laughs> 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 it. That'd be great, dude. <laughs> okay, I'm worried now. Are there ants all over this chair? Probably, Danny. Yeah. They're yeah. everywhere. Yeah. There's no food in here. No food in here. Okay. Have you guys watched the uh, Netflix anime movie, The Sea Beast? The Sea Beast? Oh my god, it's, it's, so good. it's good. It's what is really it? what is it? like halfway through it right now, but it looks like it would be Pixar. Like I saw it and we load up Disney Plus instantly. I'm like, "Oh, it's like a new movie." It has like about it. Tangled vibes. Yeah. Oh, I love Tangled. Oh, but it's about pirates/they're slash they're called hunters mm-hmm. and they're sent out into the sea to hunt down massive sea beasts. And um the main character is the main guy from The Boys. Uh he voices the main like Homelander? badass like yeah, no, not Homelander, the Bones the guy that, from Star Trek. That is not going to reference the the British guy, the main character of the boys, like the boys. He's the, in Lord of the Rings. He's the like nephew of the king. Yeah. Black hair guy, scruffy. Right? Yes, You're talking yes, about the butcher. Yes, yes butcher. Yeah, butcher. Yeah, yeah. He's butcher. Okay. But he voices the main like badass he's pirate in, guy. He's in, the in movie. butchers in uh, Lord of the Rings. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Who is he, Sam? She just told you I couldn't. I Wait, why would the, you ask him? the nephew uh, <laughs> of the uh, king who like goes crazy because he has like the it's, evil. It's guy. not Boromir. I know who you're talking about. It's the guy from Rohan. Yeah, he's like related to that girl who has a crush on the hot guy. Aragorn. Yeah. Yeah. Man, just, yeah. No, no, no. I know yeah. who he's talking about. He has like blonde hair in the yeah, he in has the blonde. movie. Yeah. He wears in like a little Lord of the Ring nerds. Pony. I just, we hate him. Yeah, trip them in the fucking yeah. ball. I swear to God. But we're about halfway Jeez. through it because I couldn't wasn't allowed to watch the rest of it because somebody wanted to go to sleep. So, but it's really good so far. It's really, okay, really cool. it's a movie. How long, how long it's is a it? movie. It's only two hours. It? Oh, that's it. Bad. Okay, yeah. cool. I'll, yeah. I'll knock it out. And the animation is crazy. Like is it it's CG su- or is it? It was a Netflix movie. So, and it's it's I don't know. It's like CG, I guess. But like, it's I like, like real. It. it looks like Pixar. It looks yeah. like it looks okay, super super good. Um. Just don't. It just, they just released on Netflix. Just oh, out, sick. I don't think it hit the theaters. It didn't hit anything, but it is fucking. Bomb. Speaking of theaters, did you see the Canon uh, Black Clover movie? It's gonna be just like Mugen Train. Oh bomb! It's gonna be literally the whole arc leading up to where the manga ends. Bomb! I, 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 so? I'm like, you, yeah. They just Yo? they straight up said. Just like Mook and Trey. That's like, going to be really cool because that whole arc is basically just a full-on assault. Dude, like, it's so fucking good. Oh, my bomb. God. I'm so excited. That's going to be really bomb. And okay. they're going to – and they're, when they animate it, they're just going to add a couple extra little Have things. Have you guys heard about the movie The Black Phone, that horror movie that's in theaters? Apparently, it's, it's to be super scary. Super, like, no. super, super good. I'm a pussy for I, that stuff. What movie were we going to watch that was scary? Nope. Yeah, we want to watch that. I, yeah. I legit, I'm interested oh, that's in that. You're saying. <laughs> <laughs> and then no, I'm, I'm interested in that one. You know, there was uh, also Jordan another Peele. movie we were going to watch that when we were looking for movies last night. Is it that The was Witch scary. Lady? No, it was already out on demand. We were looking for movies and there was a scary one. She's like, I don't want to watch this. Hereditary? Oh. No, that movie's old, fucked up, dude. Old. That movie's so that movie, fucked That's the one with Jennifer oh, Lawrence, right? Oh, yeah. No, it's one with the little girl. Oh, I thought, which is the one? With, Mother is the one with Jennifer Lawrence. That one's fucked Ew, up, too. I don't want to watch that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we were going to watch old, the M. Night Shyamalan movie that came oh, out. Oh, like, I heard it was ago. not good. Yeah. Aww. What do you expect? It's M. Night Shyamalan. So. But yeah. Okay, why is the black black phone? Yeah. Yeah. Is it like supernatural or is it like I don't know anything killer? fucking about it. I don't know I anything it was like other than having people. To do with like tech, are... you know? Is it tech? I I all I've seen is dude. Like now I'm tripping out. YouTube I feel like video, I feel... TikTok, all the things just saying how good Black Phone is, and it's like a scary. And I don't think it's like jump scary as much as it's supposed to be like really creepy. Like oh wow! Yeah. Ooh, I I like those aesthetically yeah. creepy ones. But I think I, that's what that this is. I hate jump scares. Like yeah. anything jump scare, I hate yeah. anything conjuring. I hate. Mm-hmm. I hate the conjuring. You won't watch it either. I did. No, you, I've seen The Conjuring. The well, first when, we one. Have, when we have our movie theater set up, we could have all the movie nights in the Hell world. So. Yeah. Oh, are we going to have everybody? Yeah. Oh, yeah. let's do it. Just yeah. like the old days. Did you guys notice that we had the curtains up? Were you guys over last time yeah. we had that up? Yeah, Dude. Yeah, Well, no, I, no. I, this is my first time seeing it. I you just told me on uh, Saturday. bought – so that entranceway, right when you walk in – I don't know how to describe it for everybody that hasn't seen our actual house, but our house has almost like a grand hall, like right when you walk in, like a really large living room. So we're going to put another curtain that blocks off that hall, and then it's going to be so fucking dark because the kitchen has an entrance in there, but it already has a door.
door that slides yeah, open and just shuts uh-huh. off the kitchen. So there'll be like no light that goes in there. Dude, hell yeah, that's gonna be sick. Yeah, actually. it's gonna. Be, and then Josh already said he's gonna get rid of those fucking huge ass wardrobes. Yeah, Finally, and so then yeah. we're just gonna put the projector and just have to use that wall as like a projector. It's gonna be so good. Oh, that's projector. really cool. Mm-hmm. We can use his uh, speakers. Yes, have speakers. Yeah, he still has the speakers. That's what we're gonna okay. use. We're gonna use those those speakers he's been trying to force on our TV the whole time. We're actually gonna use them for the yeah, projector. Yeah, nice. So, yeah, good. They'll actually be put they to use. They have a purpose so. now. <laughs> That'll be really cool. It's gonna be. Are you gonna get multiple seating or just like? Well, the, the couch, the couch is, is perfect, like, like super good. There ain't no problem with the couch, but it's, we could rearrange it. Oh, I just mean like you could get like those floor ones where it's like you're laying down, but yeah, it's just I like get the those. Yeah. like the little like 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 it's like the halfsy, so you can lay down. You and know still what sit. we need is we need some sort of a booster piece of wood that we put under the main couch, and then those <clears> two <throat> side chairs like we have here, we put them in front, like movie theater, so it's tiered. Oh, I want to get bean bags. You, you know what I'm talking about? Oh, I, I, I vaguely have an idea of what you're talking about. Yeah, well, like, the movie theater is tiered, so yeah. we, we would raise the couch that you guys are on, and then we put these two facing the camera right in front. Mm-hmm. Oh, so, so like just a like, an, like a setup. legit home theater. Yeah. Damn, big plans for the yeah. house, for the guild house. Pretty good, huh? It's going to be cute. Yeah, thank you. It's I'm Sam, full of good ideas. You should have kept <laughs> your uh, popcorn machine now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> just, <laughs> it's just not a good purchase ever. I, just, I like, remember he was so excited. He's like, Guys, guess it's what I bought? Guess what I bought? I eat popcorn every day. <laughs> and, uh, and he made it once. It's too much. <laughs> <laughs> because everybody thinks of how great. Okay, it would be maybe a good purchase if it was in the living room. But I just worry that with the ventilation in the house, the whole house will just smell of popcorn. And not to nobody mention that wants ants. to smell of that all the time. <laughs> nobody wants. And especially after you've just gobbled popcorn, you don't want to smell popcorn the rest of the day. So it's just not fun ever. Yeah, I mean, you like uh, you like popcorn bags, right? Yeah. 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 Where Perfect. You, that's all you need. That's all you that's need. That's what I'm saying. And then I got a little Maybe bit of extra machine. salt that I just mm-hmm. doused in there. A little. I got some of that shitty butter. You go. No, you the cannot spray use butter? that. <clears throat> no, that made it's him like, so sick. It's like liquid. You, it's oh, like, oh, yes. I know what you're oh, talking yeah, about. It's like a bottle of oil. Yeah, it looks like oil, but it's like straight butter. It's bomb. Mm. It's so good. That's exactly what they use at movie theaters. Yeah. I bought some pretzels, little pretzel bites, um, but we let them mold before we ever actually eat them. So. I, Twice now. Yeah. They have, um, what is it, King's Hawaiian, little pretzel oh, bites. Oh, yeah. yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay. I, we haven't been able to find them, though. So, But they have, they make, like, pretzel bites of their bread. Are they she uh, loves Costco? King's Hawaiian. I love I don't know. Hawaiian. I saw Dude, them, me too. I saw them online. It they have the a restaurant in Torrance. What, King's Hawaiian? Yeah. Fresh. <laughs> hey, it, I don't know. Be there, but we'll go. Bread. Mm-hmm. Oh, Sounds good. Well, things like actual menu items that you could get on there. So. But, like, based well, around their bread. Yeah, sure. Sure, sure. Oh, my God. Okay. I had the best Krispy Kreme experience in the world when I went. Okay, it was. Let me paint you a picture. Wednesday, super uh-huh. late. I'm getting off at midnight on Wednesday, so technically you could say it's Thursday. I go from my work. I go drive all the way to the block slash the outlet store. It's like a 30 minute drive to mm-hmm. go there. I'm like, I'm gonna give me some Krispy Kreme. Katie's been talking about forever wanting Krispy Kreme, but we just never have time to go. So sh- I'll pick them up. I'll bring them home. We got some nice midnight Krispy Kreme. It's gonna be delicious. So I roll up to Krispy Kreme. Krispy Kreme, there's no one in line. Like, it's fucking dead. Like, 1230. Hell yeah. And I I was like, let me just get – and I call Josh, by the way, because I'm like, let me offer – you know, I know that man's a pig. Let me (laughs) offer him some Krispy Kreme. I know he wanted – he doesn't answer. No answer. And I'm like, I had already asked him earlier to give me the dimensions of the curtains. He blew me off. He doesn't pick up. All right, I ain't getting shit. What if you're in jail? I know. I know. (laughs) I know. Exactly, Danny. So I roll up and I'm like, hey, can I just get like a, a dozen glazed donuts? Yeah, yeah, next window. So I pull out this girl's out there and she's like, she's like, hey, um, I'm not really supposed to do this, but I'm just going to give you our Wednesday deal. And I was oh. like, I was like, okay. It's like, thanks. She's like, all right, your total is $4. What? I'm like, what? Like, what? It's like, okay. It's like, wow, thanks. I took like, yeah, no problem. And so like I gave her my card because normally like Krispy Kreme dozen is like 12, 15 bucks. Like it's expensive. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, baller. And then so I'm sitting there waiting for my food. It's one girl and a guy is like picking the donuts with thing. He's no joke going, Massa got me working. <laughs> and I'm just, no way. I'm just dying, dude. <laughs> and I just like look at him. He looks at me. Master got me working. <laughs> and I'm just like, I don't know. Does he want me to complete the rest of the song? Like, he, like am I supposed to go working real hard? <laughs> just like, I'll, I think it's okay for you, right? Yeah, like, no, well, there's another white guy in there. Oh, he's there's another, another white guy, guy in there. there. And I'm just like, all right. And then so he comes over. He, I see him like bagging up a donut. He's like, this is for you, sir. And I'm like, oh, and I look at it. It's another glazed donut. He just gave me a glazed donut <laughs> while I'm waiting. So I'm just like munching on a donut. Yeah. And then he goes like, here's your dozen. I'm like, 
Thanks. <laughs> 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 and I just drive off. I'm like, that was the best Krispy Kreme experience I could ever have. Master it's like, has they gave working. me a donut to wait for, <laughs> and then I got a whole ass dozen for four dollars. Like, that's the way you do it. W- were you happy, Katie? Let me tell you <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> how I was already asleep for two hours by the time he gets home. Wait, you go to sleep at 10? She has yes. to get up for work at like six o'clock in the morning. So, I mean, so do I. <laughs> Whatever, Jose. What are you trying to say? <laughs> I go to sleep at new, uh, midnight. Ew. <laughs> so I'm asleep, dead asleep, don't hear him come in or anything. And then, you know, just on my back. Angelically sleeping. sleeping. Yep, in the cutest way possible. <laughs> and then he grabs a donut and slowly starts shoving it into my <laughs> <laughs> Now, Sam, in your perspective, you're like, oh, she's okay, going to love this. Okay, now, to be this. fair, I, she's there like this, like, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, this is perfect. <laughs> I just like have Donna, and I put up to her lips, and first she's like, Ugh. and then she goes, <laughs> smells it with her pig nostrils, okay, <laughs> and then she opens her mouth, like, and so I put it in there, and she starts, she bites down, she's like, eyes closed, she has not open eyes at all the whole time, she's like, mm-hmm. and just like starts eating it, just like <laughs> still asleep, like just. Oh, oh my dude, god, dude! Lord, you just describe what I do to Sirius. When Sirius is knocked the fuck out, I think it's funny. I'll put a Dorito right in front of his nose and just watch him go. Why am I being compared to your dog? Jose? <laughs> it's just the way he sniffs and it goes. Yeah, same it, exact it, thing it, happened. Same exact thing happened. Then she started just munch. I fed her a whole ass donut before she opened her eyes. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> I was tired. A whole donut, dude. <laughs> Didn't even know what happened. No, you know? No, no. Woke up and was like, yeah. mm-hmm. why is my mouth so sweet? You know? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, that's the best possible way to yeah. wake up ever. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, and then she ate a whole ass another half of a donut. Can so. Danny expect to be woken up like that? Mm-hmm. Who? Me. Danny. Oh, yeah, of course, Danny. I'll just be like the donut, cri- like Santa. I'll just go, <laughs> I'll just go door to door, and I'll just start shoving. Shove I'll go to Ryan's door, I'll put a little yeah. donut in his mouth. I'll come over your door, put a little donut in your mouth. It's like Josh, I can't get into. Well, I know where his key is, so. <laughs> Or you I'll got just, two donuts. For good old times, I'll just ninja star him with a donut. Yeah, 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 you have to. <laughs> That's you're going to risk seeing, you know, something yeah. you don't want to see. Just go <laughs> whap <laughs> right the wall. He'll get rain down with glaze. And like, He's going to freak the fuck out. He's just going to hear a loud <laughs> boom. What's that? That's a target for the ants right there. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh my God. No, that's for sure, dude. All the fucking glaze, that's their new dude. Home. That's why I told Katie when we were waiting, because, like, we'd killed them all, and, like, we resealed our thing. I'm like, really? Long game is like the bear situation. We just got to wait for them to go to somebody else's room. <laughs> it's like, we just got to wait them out. And what they do? Went right to the kitchen, and they went right to Josh's room. So, Oh, my God. I feel like it's no easier more. access to go to his room, right? Like, I feel like. Well, that's what I, th- I legitimately think the ants are in the wall. Like, there's yeah. just no other real explanation to it. Um, because they're coming through the roof. Like, it, we're oh, in our, going up in the too. Ceiling. Holy yeah. shit. Yeah. Like, you guys have an attic? Yeah, 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 we do. We do. Have you checked? Well, the attic is in uh, <coughs> Loanne's room right above us. So oh, okay. you got to go like literally on top of her. Like she has a closet with like a, uh, a shelf on there. You got to get on the shelf and go into the attic, which the internet guy will have to do once you officially move in. So <laughs> he, he loves, loves it. <laughs> he loves it. Like I said, I can he just loves route, it. like a long ass Ethernet yeah, cable yeah. from your router yeah, yeah. to my room. That's totally, it. That's totally, all I need. Totally, totally. Yeah, That's can. what I got. Our new Roomba might not like that, but that'd be, that'd be fine. So Your Roomba's funny. Yeah. He's I'll so trail it across the ceiling. It's fine. Oh, good, good, good. Thank you. Yeah. Did you guys buy anything for Prime Day? No. I was Hell looking, no. I was just looking for shelving and stuff. I oh. wanted to. I wanted to buy something, but I couldn't find anything to buy. There's so well, much, Well, that was not Danny. the problem for some people on There's this. I could no, tell. I could nothing fucking appealing. tell. I don't know. <laughs> well, oh, I don't, I don't want to talk about it. Was there nothing appealing on Prime Day, Katie? Go ahead. Nope, nothing else. <laughs> <laughs> no? It has been a competition between her and Josh to who gets the most packages delivered. <laughs> the poor Amazon guy walks up to our house, I'm not even joking, every day, carrying almost like like a, a shed's worth of stuff. Like he has like a carrying container that he brings Dude. up with him filled with packages to our door. Like he's like pulling it behind him like a wagon uh-huh. yeah, to our front yeah, door. Yeah. And then you think like, oh, that must be from multiple houses. Nope. He just sits his ass there and goes, one, two. And we'll have like 10. Like, <laughs> if anybody, like, package thieves want to find a house, like, our house is primo. It's like I Christmas know. morning. I know. So every day, it's like, open up. Oh, there's 10 packages there. Oh, there's fucking a large one and three small ones. Let me just go and drive in. <laughs> and there'll be multiple Amazon deliveries that'll happen. They'll have multiple people come to the door each day. Jesus. Our living room is flooded in boxes. Yeah, it just is. 
in packing boxes, just everything. Would you say they have a shopping addiction? Yes, hundred percent, hundred percent. No. <laughs> we got here's what I've seen purchased so far from just my heathen alone. Oh, I can ex- describe Josh as well. I know exactly what he bought too. Katie has bought matching robes for us, so we each have robes. They're waffle. That's for you, Danny. Wait, you got for him us? robes? No, well, no. We have robes. Oh, oh, so, so you don't walk benefit. into. <laughs> oh, <for our laughs> so, thank you. So, <laughs> so we have matching robes now. Um, we have a Roomba. We have a vacuum. We have. Uh, she bought razor earbuds twice, which just continues my hatred of razors. Twice. I hate them so much. Why? Okay, so they're like twice. she specifically well, wanted. Well, the first one was defective, and yeah. so was the second one. She specifically wanted earbuds that don't have the plastic tip on like them. Like the yeah. bubble. Yeah. Yeah. So she bought the razor hammerheads because, like, they could just go right in the ear. They look like, like the just like earpods. Yeah. You don't like the regular AirPods? They die too fast. It's not worth it. Well, really? she has really That's old what I've ones. Had. She has really old ones. So she was trying to find something that was not. So she went Razor. They had good reviews, whatever. But as with all fucking things that are Razor, they're just the shittiest thing in the world. Yep. Um, so she charged them. The first one she charged, like, all day, brought them into work. And for some reason, the right earphone just doesn't work. No matter what you do, no touch input. It, like, doesn't register Ugh. anything. So then I Googled it. I fucked around with it for a little bit. And it was just like, nah, 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 nah. So she returned it, got a new one. Same thing happened. She charged it for extra long because, like, a lot of people were saying if it's not charged all the way, like, it does some weird, like it charges the left and then the right, like it fucks up. So you got to charge all the way. So we left it for like the full 24 hours charging this thing. Brought it into work. It was working fine. And then at some point she reopened the case. The right earphone's not working anymore. There's not working anymore. And I'm just like, that is just the most stupid thing I've ever seen. Mm-hmm. And they know it's a problem because they have on their official FAQ what to do if your right earphone's not working. <laughs> stupid fucking razor. Yeah. Why don't you just I, fix it? I hate their fucking guts. So. Return those, which, by the way, she made sure to bring us to the Target near your house, Jose. All the way <laughs> down there? Yeah. So she was like, oh, I got it from our Target. I'm like, oh, which one? Oh, like the one that's like not the Westminster Mall. I'm like, okay, cool. And then we're coming back on the way. We had Maggiano's for dinner. Coming back home. Damn. And yeah. Sorry, bud. I know. That place was delicious. Oh, we might as well take a side, a side tour. Go ahead, Catherine. I invited both of you. When? You invited who? When did you, uh, when? I told him to, but you not guys. Us. When? No, no, no. And he not, said no. That oh. is, okay, first of all, I do this not for us? the people. I do this for the people because I don't want you guys to waste the podcast content before the podcast. But my that thought has had. There. I, I'm, I'm guilty of that. I tell Sam every fucking so thing. So we need to be like isolated before we do the podcast and then we can go do something. So what do we do when you guys come over and swim at my place? That's fine. That's fine. That's, That's fine. fine. That's fine. It can't be before because then the load gets blown. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. Okay, but it's not what I was delegating. Um, <laughs> I don't know what you're talking Katie about. Katie has something to call you out about, Danny. Is it oh. Vampire Diaries? No. It has to do with Maggiano's. Ooh. Oh. Danny, how could you? <laughs> there you Those go. lemon cookies are delicious. Oh, because you call them dry as fuck, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's what the frost was. That was your birthday? For. Yeah. No, I said it was Danny's birthday, and I was trying to be nice and not eat them because they're Danny's. But then he just trashed on them. They made those with their whole heart, Danny. The strawberry was ass. It was old <laughs> ass strawberries. I don't care about the strawberries. And, and about the lemon cookies. The lemon cookies. We're going to try. Yeah. <laughs> they're delicious. <laughs> they didn't have enough icing. <laughs> they're watching out for your health. <laughs> <laughs> well, was it your birthday this time that you went? Hmm? Should have been. We didn't say it was anybody's <laughs> birthday. Oh, you just ordered them? Yeah. Yeah, Sam embarrassed us enough. What happened? <laughs> he made such an inappropriate comment, and the waiter walked by, and he immediately left. What do you do? Oh, no. I don't even know if I can say it on the podcast. <laughs> oh, no. It was, oh, like, no. rated R to the, like, <laughs> utmost extreme. Was he talking about doing you or something? I mean, he referred something to bread and butter. <laughs> you can use your imagination. <laughs> Okay, and then so. he said it right as the waiter was walking up okay. to us. And he was just so like, here's where I found out away. that the booth we were in, our waiter is like, you know how like sometimes they have the wall up and then like the little cash register is right behind it. Like and the so side yeah. station. That's where they fill up the drinks also was literally right behind our booth. Like, oh. So he kept, <laughs> he kept Batmaning our table. Like you wouldn't know where he came from. And he's there. Like he's just there. <laughs> So, like, she was showing me, like, look, I warm up the, the butter, like, in between my thighs, and then I put it in there. And so this is too TMI. I can't believe she brought this up. So then well, she, I wasn't oh going to no. explicitly she, say what you said. She was showing me she put the butter 
like open it and put it right inside. She's like, look how melty it is. I'm like, it looks like your vagina fill up with cum. And then <laughs> our, our waiter is like right there. You like Batman himself on yeah. the table. You just like quickly make sure to keep watching. <laughs> just, doesn't your grandma listen to this? It's, uh, she doesn't make it this far. <laughs> It was so <laughs> yeah, embarrassing. <laughs> well, you did that last time. You know, you put the butter. Your pops the watches this. That's Let the way to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah he's, he's heard worse. Yeah, yeah you're, you're right. You did Chris, it last time. He has Chris as a yeah. son. But then yeah. you guys just took a bit too far. He took it he too took, far. Yeah, I think he did. I was just trying to enjoy my bread. He enjoys your bread. Thank you, Jose. <laughs> King. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to have a good time, and then like I'm like I'm saying, why is he Batmaning all the time? Like, give us a little <laughs> bit of warning. Like, he should have been like <clears throat> like Alfred, you know. He's definitely one of the worst waiters we had because he took our bread basket at the end. Oh, uh, he I just liked didn't want to. Him. Keep... He, he was sucked. so nice. He, sucked. he was too awkward. He sucked. He was awkward after that comment. <laughs> <laughs> That's awkward. what made him awkward. He was awkward from the start. He was awkward from the start. He was lovely. If you didn't like the comment, not my fault. Kind of is. No, you, not you my fault. It. You said it, man. What do you think the white sauce is made of? That ain't my fault. <laughs> I know what the white sauce at Olive Garden is made of. You know? Yeah, yeah. We, don't go, sure. we don't go there, okay? Yeah, Olive Garden's trash, like unironically trash. Compared to Magiana's, it is. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she just wanted to go to Spaghetti Factory. Hey, oh, yeah. I want to go. Uh-huh. Let's go. I'd be down. Mazithra? Huh? <laughs> you, you're too passionate Why about that. Yeah. <laughs> you're just very into it. <laughs> Food's her thing. She loves it. Okay, so w- uh, let's take a step back. Why didn't we get an invite to Manjamos? I already explained. He said he didn't want it us to talk the about content. it. Yeah. He didn't want us to talk everything out before, and, and then, then it have not to be recreate fresh it. When did you guys go? Right like an hour podcast. before we came here. Hmm. <laughs> you didn't get an invite, Danny. They don't, you only don't checked your phone. <laughs> I've already told you. Hmm. Okay. Danny, I was going to shoot you an invite, but I decided not to. You're welcome. You didn't even like that place. I'm going to remember that. He did that. like it. I didn't get an in- invite to boys night, so I don't want to hear shit from the man across. Mm. The- what the oh. fuck? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's right. He had yeah. boys night on Friday I night. Called, like, it I is, it, it's guys I night, no fucking- okay? You guys are the boys. But not and the then, boys. No. And then there's guys, the guys, okay? So it's different. It's a different group. You guys all, all right, fall all right. under the umbrella of the homies, but they're right, subsets. Right. Which one's better? All right, the guild... Or it's equal. Uh, the guild or the guys, and we're hanging off a, a cliff. Who you save? Yeah, you can only save one group. There's no saving both. Don't but you think. live with one, Danny, so choose wisely. <laughs> <laughs> Let them both die. <laughs> is that a choice? No. Yeah, is that, is that where you start villain arc part two? Nope. Not a choice. You have to pick one. Obviously, the guild. <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't sound very convincing. That, that hesitation. Uh, I said it, so it must be true. Yeah, on camera too. So mm-hmm. I'm gonna show you other friends. Next time you tag them on Instagram, I'm gonna click each one of their profiles. I'm gonna send them <laughs> send that clip. <laughs> Danny said he would let you all die. Toxic. Yep. Toxic. Well, well, that'd be I mean, the end it, of that. It's mm-hmm. the house. Okay, I thought Katie was a toxic one. You're not. So it really is him, huh? Mm-hmm. It is Danny. Oh, it is. Yeah. Wow. No, it ain't. Mm-hmm. I ain't threatening to kill people over strawberries. That is just not the case. <laughs> <laughs> look at this. Look at this I thought we were talking heck? about it. I just bought them. Was she gonna pay you back? No. Did she she gave me a pathetic offer, and then I told Josh today that he has to go to Sprouts and get me organic five dollars strawberries. And he said, "Okay." I'm sorry. I'm surprised he didn't just send you the money. If I was Josh, like when I broke his glass, his four dollar glass. He charged me $9 for a better glass. I'll be sure to buy two packs of strawberries and charge him for it. <laughs> <laughs> what is this household? It's very toxic. <laughs> what is this household? Like, just don't break anything, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just be in my room. <laughs> just don't leave your space. Yeah. Man. I'll be in my hey, room, man. Did you tell Ryan about this? Nah, he's coming into a war zone. Oh. <laughs> He knows, he knows. Right, he like, knows. Hey, guys. You just stepped on that crack right there, Ryan. Yeah. You fucked up. Has he seen the room yet? Uh, I sent him pictures. Pictures? He's okay. been here yeah. before. 
But I don't think he's ever he, been. I don't like, think in he got room. to see the rooms. But I told him it's huge. It's yeah. like just as big as your room. It's like it's so big. And mm. he's like, oh, I just need like some space to like set up my like computer. I'm like, die, you will have so much space in that room. Like, <laughs> so is he just bringing like a bed and a computer? He's gonna bring some of his stuff. Okay, cool. Yeah. But I don't know if he's gonna bring all of it. He's really just because he has to drive an hour to work an hour back right now. So gotcha. That's like, so where is he at? Like right now? I Torrance. Think he's like Torrance. Yeah. yeah. Torrance, and yeah. he has to drive where? Costa uh, Mesa. Costa, Costa Mesa. Oh, yeah. yeah that's it, he's no literally yeah. right next to the Weston, I think. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. So now he's gonna just chill. He's gonna come right by. Easy, easy peasy. Right. We have a, we have a content house now. Hell yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. Yeah. It's the boys. Mm-hmm. Okay. Jump that nice. So it should be kicked out. It'll be a full on content house. So. We got numbers. We'll see. Yeah. We'll jump our ass. You want? To I could take Dude, could, could you imagine if we all lived together? It'd be hell. Yeah. Break up with Bridie and come move in. No, I like Bridie. Make her move in too. Well, we can't have your dog. So kill your dog and then. You I can't. Move. I like the dog. What the fuck? I choose the dog. <laughs> 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 he he barks a lot though. Yeah, you know. Yeah, he barks dog. a lot. He can't come in the house. We have too many Amazon people. He doesn't bark Uh-oh. at people who come to the door. He barks at people that walk by. I mean, it's too many animals in his household, anyways. That's hey. for sure. Because we're Why all. Why are you beasts. looking at me, Danny? <laughs> 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 You're not getting any of her pho, dude. I, I'm not. Her pho. Yeah, yeah she's, she's supposed to be best. Man, remember, you guys are supposed to be best friends. We are besties. That's why I can't. Oh, open uh, if you guys are besties, ask her if she's gonna help with your mattress on Saturday. <laughs> I don't have to ask because I know. I, I know her. she's going to. No, I day. know she's going to help me out. <laughs> Just kill, she's not even looking at you. Yet. Go ahead and ask her, Doug. No. This, that's, how, that's how deep our friendship Can runs. Like, I don't I need to ask. I have a previous engagement that day. <laughs> <laughs> I have a previous engagement. You knew. <laughs> I didn't do I told you. <laughs> okay. okay you I, have, what about the others? <laughs> that's all them. Josh is working. So, so it's just you and Sam? Out. He's also working, apparently. No, I don't have my work schedule yet, as I said, in a group chat, because I'm a good friend. Maybe I yeah. work that well, day. Well, Jose, I'm moving in the morning on Damn Saturday, it. if you're free. <laughs> Which <laughs> I know you are. How, so, how do you know? Yeah, because you work Monday through Friday, bitch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> true, 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 true. And he owes you, because you helped him move. So, true. Good mm-hmm. point. I helped you move twice. Yeah, that's blank true, slate, Blank slate, <laughs> blank slate. <laughs> <laughs> With a reset button. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> is it because you turned 30? Yeah. Exactly. Uh, all right. Exactly. Everyone gets one in a decade. Mm-hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. What what time? <laughs> um, I'm thinking of getting a U-Haul in the morning, maybe like nine or ten. I I'm I'm in. I'm in. There you go. There I you usually go. wake up at like eight. I hate myself. <laughs> Dude, I can't sleep in anymore. I get uh, headaches. Dude, uh-huh. I can't sleep workout. in anymore either. <sighs> that mattress was hell, Sam. Danny. That mattress was hell. It was hell. What is up with this mattress? Why you, is it such a you, it's, you have to lay in it though. Afterwards, lay in it, you'll understand. I have fallen asleep in your it's mattress. It's like before. Tempur-Pedic or something, so it has no structure to it at all, and it's super heavy. So like you're trying to move it, and it's just like, it's like floppy, floppy. <laughs> and like it's so it just weighs way more than what it's worth. How are you gonna get it up those stairs? I we just got to push it up the stairs. Easy. Yeah. 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 And then slide Once it. it's re- resting, just someone already, has to lift it as you go up. We carried it up his last set of stairs. Yep. Yeah. Because his last stairs were like gravel. So yeah. we couldn't like slide it. We could slide it uh, these bitches. That's nice. Yeah. The hard so part is just going to be getting it to the U-Haul from my place. Yeah. Mm. But uh, getting yeah. it up here. You have to run the fucking gauntlet again. Jesus. Jesus. No, so you guys don't have to do that. I'm going to get RJ to put it in okay. the U-Haul. So okay. you, you guys get the easy part. Okay. Oh, okay, cool. So RJ's yeah. going to help you load it in and then he's just going to fuck off? Yeah, he lives next to me. Oh, does, oh, he? does he really? He lives in the same complex. Oh, oh no way. Yeah. Okay. I didn't know that. Yeah, I got him, uh, or I referred him there, so they gave us like a three hundred dollar referral oh, bonus. Hey. Oh, sick! Yeah. Didn't help you break in the lease, though. Mm-hmm. Huh? He did not. <laughs> <laughs> does his have a uh, washer dryer unit on the balcony like yours? He does not. Oh, he lives in one jealous. of like the central buildings yeah. where he has to go to like one of the places, uh, the centralized Damn. washer dryer. He's in- and he's he said his shit's been missing. So people, oh, just, uh, so people, people just steal been stealing. Yeah. So like he leaves it, walks away, and then yeah. comes back to. You're not gonna wait there for an hour, Mm-mm. you know. Damn, he's in the poor side. That's unfortunate, though. Yeah, no, you guys, yours was nice. I, I yeah. liked your apartment. It was nice. Well, do we have any thieves here? Hmm? Um, Anyone guys steal my underwear? No thieves, but if you leave your stuff in the washer or dryer for too long, they will throw it on the floor. Oh, whoa. Even if there's like a basket next to it? My stuff gets put in the basket. Oh. I thought she was going to say your, your strawberries get thrown away, man. That's for sure. <laughs> too soon. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing safe in this house. That's okay. My roommate, when she washes, she forgets that her clothes is in there for like a whole week. That's Josh. 
I get so fucking heated. I'm like, Jesus, fuck. For a good reason. What right? about you guys? I'm, look, you I'm guys not sticking my hands in there. in there for uh, a whole week? No, because mm-hmm. I'm normally the one that does the laundry. Hey, gang, gang. I get my shit out ASAP. You mm-hmm, know? mm-hmm. Me you too, You set a timer? No, I just... You just know I when just to come back. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. You wait an hour, it's done. No, they normally put it on the couch if it's like in the dryer and someone needs to switch. All right, I feel like it's fair. I'm going to be doing that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. We'll it's see. So good. I too am going to time it when you put your stuff in there for an hour and then I'm just going to run down. He's going to meet you down here. He's like, mm-hmm. Danny, you're late. Okay. My laundry days are sat- uh, Sundays. All right. So, you know. All right. Ours are Sunday now too. <laughs> Shut the fuck <laughs> up. <laughs> uh, what time? Uh, about. All day. See. Well, you're not supposed to use it in the middle of the day because that's peak energy usage time. Yeah, so. you're supposed to wait till like uh, we'll what? do like seven o'clock, five or seven, seven a.m., p.m. Yeah, you suck. <laughs> <laughs> you suck. You're gonna do like what, ten loads in a row? We only ever do like two or three. Yeah, we usually do one of clothes, one of towels. Same. Oh, oh my god, we have so much in common. Yeah, ah, besties. besties. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you know, we should do our towels together. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Save water. Yeah. Yeah. I have bougie stuff. She has reusable dust balls. What? What are those? Or oh, like the ones you throw in the dryer? Yeah, they're like wool balls. Yeah, yeah. Fancy. <laughs> they okay. look like garbage. Like, they're eco-friendly. <laughs> I was watching her. She's pulling out laundry. She's like, oh, there's another ball in here somewhere. <laughs> she's, like, she's like tearing apart clothes, like trying to find this other ball. Are they to like help dry faster? The she has no fucking idea Jose. what they do. Okay, I, they're I, good for the environment. Uh, they're just eco-friendly. There we go. I use dry sheets. Yeah, scumbag. That's smart. I like dry sheets so though. Wasteful. Yeah, that's like when we had the bathroom for a while. She got rid of the like the Febreze spray you use after you poop. Yeah, and she's just like, oh, I have like a what is it? What is the little machine that you have in there? Diffuser. Diffuser. Just oh. use the diffuser. That shit never worked. It's just like <laughs> he broke it. <laughs> no, oh, doesn't no. it have a fan? No, it just spritzes. Oh, you guys don't have a fan in your. We bathroom? don't have any fan or like any vent. So if you turn the air, so on, you just can't stuck feel it in there. there. You guys have window, right? Yeah, there is a window. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's where ants come in from. Yeah, and then like I told her how crappy that was because like you know when you poop, it's like you, it's stuck in there. Yeah, like what are you supposed to do? And it's like oh, I'll buy some stuff. So she bought three sticks, like three like la- like I don't know like, scented sticks. It's the oh. oil. Diffuser. It's the oil diffusers. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's, where you soak them in like Yeah, the, you soak them in and they're like in the little and jar. And like you flip them so they remain fresh. You keep flipping. Yeah, I don't know how effective that is. Like, I've never seen yeah. her do that before in my life. I didn't know you were supposed to soak them in something. No, you flip them. It, Mine it, don't it, soak. You you stick them into a thing. And so there's liquid about this much in here. And so part she of it is here. You pull it out liquid. and then you stick it back in. Mine come pre-soaked. And then when they dry out, I have a new set. Do those work? <laughs> I bought him a spray. Not smell them, dog. <laughs> I can smell them. I can smell them. I've never smelled them. Get him incense this time. I bought him a spray because it's poop stinks. <laughs> Dude, all I said is I just want to spray or like some poopery, you know? It's <laughs> poopery. <laughs> just to mask it for a minute. Yes, so, yeah. yes. I don't see him buying any. Why don't you get those, uh, whatever Josh has. He's, he's got his bathroom poopery. smells. Is that what it is? He just likes the noises. <laughs> She's like the microphone has a little spring and she's just going <laughs> It's like jeez I'm sure the audio for that microphone is fucked yeah. the past ten minutes. Like, oh my god. Let yeah. me tell you how he hated Josh doing this. It has been a long time since I've had to listen to that. But for anybody who's not gonna watch Joseph, he used to like do this in the microphone. Yeah, he. he and I'm like, what oh, is that? Is he chewing like, on something? No, he, he just hit him back in his lips. Mi- yes, <sighs> it's just like the moisture on his lips. And I'm like, dude, it was so just loud. Just smacking time. them lips, dude. Just practicing making out with the uh, ghost. It is yeah, probably. so loud. I'm like, dude, that is obnoxious. So bad. So do we hate Josh? Or yeah, I think so. No, no, no. The latest thing that was said is, Josh, I like you more than your girlfriend. So <laughs> I did say that we're, earlier today. <laughs> we're making big big leaps and bounds. Right, That's so, good. So, I'm so proud the, of so you So guys. the house rankings from uh, like worst to best. Okay, worst, honey. Okay. Okay. Next. Josh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, after that. The other. Okay. Wow. Okay. Wow. Okay. Anybody else is mellow. There's nice. nobody else here. There you go. It's us and Danny. Well, I'm gonna be here. You'll probably rank above Sam. Oh, besties oh. <laughs> <laughs> making fun together every day. <laughs> I support this household. 
God damn. I just built a coat rack. It had three pieces to screw into <laughs> each other. <laughs> Dude, I, I need love IKEA rides. this weekend. All right, oh, I, I need. Oh. I need oh. We love IKEA. I need one of you guys or both of you guys. Me, what time? Me, I'm me. down. Oh, I fucking all love it. Okay. Let's go on a trip. Uh, Brighty might join. Well, I gotta buy a bed frame. How am I supposed to buy a bed frame with all you guys in the car? We can have two cars. I got a good car for furniture. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. Okay, let's I do it. I got a good car, dog. Last time I went I'm to Mexican, IKEA, I'm Mexican, dude. Trash. I don't need a seatbelt. Yeah. Nice. Mm-hmm. Fucking love IKEA. Yeah, IKEA is fucking dope. Last time they went, Josh and her were still friends. So that's when he was on his good behavior. <laughs> well, maybe uh, you know you and Anna, you can go, you know, patch things up. Little girls uh, trip, yeah. Mm-hmm. Go to a food court, get mm-hmm. some Swedish meatballs. Ooh, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, mm-hmm. ooh. <laughs> she does like the food. They're gonna stab each she other to does. death. Yep. Get matching tattoos. She's gonna make me bleed with her shark teeth. What? <laughs> <laughs> I didn't hear it. Nah, I just gotta move on from that one. <laughs> don't bring that one up. We don't want to open that one. So, <laughs> oh hell, Danny, are you keeping up with my hair, Academia? No, I'm not. Oh, my God, dude. I'm you not. do not know how good it is right now. It's super good. Danny. Deku is a great main character. Danny, what are your uh, thoughts on Deku as a main character? He was okay so far. Mm-hmm. So I caught up in the manga up to, like, that shitty fucking arc. That, Which one? Season five. Um, It's like the two classes are go- competing oh, against. That's the beginning yeah. of season five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, competing mm-hmm. against each other. Like, I, I stopped right there because it was just like a drag. It's too much. Yeah, it was even worse having to read that week to week. That nope. was the worst by far. By far. So once I troop through that, right, it gets better. Yeah, yeah. Right away. Like, yeah. Im- literally right, immediately. Because, okay. like, that, that killed it for me. Oh, yeah. It was really bad. That was the worst arc in the whole series for sure. Which kind of sucks. So. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But, uh. Good night, Poon Poon. That's the next. I think I'm ready. Are, are you sure? Bye. I think I'm ready. Are you sure? Yeah, mentally, right. I'm the strongest I've ever been. All right, so. w- <laughs> what was the last thing you read? Um, His mom was being abused by the dad. So, like, the first volume. That's, like, real early. Yeah. yeah, really yeah. early. The first six chapters okay. is what okay. I read. Okay. So, I mean, that was, like, the darkest thing yeah. I- I've noticed so far. Okay. It's, it's good, good, dude. That's you, good. Even more raw. Uh, it's good. It's good. I think it's good. I don't think it's as crazy as everybody says. I think it's good. I enjoyed it very much. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's just like it was definitely one of those where I, when I was done, I was like, "Glad it ain't me." <laughs> 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 it's it's just it's fucked up. You're good. Yeah, you'll be fine, Danny. You'll survive. Berserk is what I want to read. Like, oh next, my god, read all that we bomb. Are you excited for his friend continuing it? I think the first chapter already out. You guys really? want to read the first chapter of uh, Chainsaw Man? Season yes, two? sir, I did. Hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Did hey. you read all of Chainsaw Man? No. You'd love it. Bomb. That's coming out in October. It's so. on my list. You can just watch it when it comes out. It's going to come out with Bleach. Yeah. It'll be good. And Blue Lock. Mm-hmm. How many seasons do you think Chainsaw Man's going to be? They could really. I don't know. It depends how long they want to milk it because yeah. it's like the whole like first arc's done. Like it's done. Like it even like stopped. Like everybody thought it was going to be the end and they're like, nah, we're doing season two. It's because we live in the ghetto. <laughs> All right. That sounds like gunshots. Yeah, it did. Jeez. Well, hopefully it was at sure. the poor side of the street, so we'll survive that. It'll be fine. <laughs> well, is Chainsaw Man complete? Is it like the, done? F- the yeah. whole first arc yeah. is. It leaves off on a pretty oh. like decent cliffhanger. So it's going to continue. Not like a it's bad one. It's already continued. The first chapter yeah. just came out like last week. Yeah. So It was good, though. I like I mm-hmm. that first chapter. I was like, damn. Was mm-hmm. not expecting that. It's super, super good. So that one's good. Then, like, Blue Lock. I want to catch up on Blue Lock again. Same. <laughs> and Revengers should almost be finished, right? I have no fucking idea. She wants to start reading Tokyo Revengers. So. I love Tokyo Do Revengers. Mm-hmm. I got a little bit further. I think I got, like, maybe 10 chapters past whatever, where it ends right now. Okay. So it's, it's still it's still a little keeping me, like, interested yeah. in it. Yeah, it'll be interesting. Tokyo Revengers is doing a crossover with, like, uh, some Switch game. Really? Yeah, I almost want to say Ninjala, but I don't know if that's 100% for sure. The fuck? Yeah. I, saw, I mean, I it would make sense, it. though. Yeah. I don't know why they didn't just have a Tokyo Avengers, like, game or something. I don't know what they're doing. Or at least a mobile game. Like, makes no fucking sense. Have a, what's that company? Cyber 2 Connect? Oh, Cyber Connect. Cyber yeah. Connect? Yeah. 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 Have it make it. I think they're supposed to be working on something new, but they are still pumping up content for that Demon Slayer game they came out with. So. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Was that any good? Uh, I, didn't I think you about bought it, it right? You didn't, I don't think you ever played it, though. Potentially. Uh, yeah, I don't think you ever played it. They just added Tang in to it. So that's the last thing I saw. Like, literally just out in the entertainment. Art. I like him a lot. He's all right. You barely, you barely get to see him, so I can't be bothered. 
We're going to start out My Hero Academia again once we start get back to watching anime. So, she wanted to watch fucking Heart of Dixie. Danny, you know Heart of Dixie? Was I CW? don't. It was a CW show. Heart of Dixie. I don't, I don't know yeah. what that it's is. It's so good, Danny. Okay, what's the premise? It's, like, what, what's it about? Okay, it's about a doctor from New York. And she has no bedside manner, and she didn't get, like, the scholarship she wanted or whatever. So she has to go and be, like, a like family practice doctor for a little bit so she can become nicer. So she goes to Alabama because there's this random guy. He's like, come work at my thing. Like, come work with me, blah, blah. And she goes there, and he's dead. And she's like, how have I been getting all these postcards? And he said that even when he's dead, he wrote a bunch so they could be sent to her in the future because later you find out that guy's her dad. <gasps> is that a spoiler? And, and the mom had an affair. It like tells you within like the first couple episodes, like first three episodes. <laughs> and so she like she likes a small town life, but she's a New York City girl. I don't know about this. It's so cute, Danny. <laughs> I don't know about this. You watch Vampire Diaries? Yeah, when I was eighteen. <laughs> That's supposed to mean <laughs> it's juvenile. She's, I, from, she's I was, still champ, just absolutely champing through. It Vampire sucks Diaries. so much, but I'm like almost done. I have to finish it. I've never finished Vampire Diaries. Really? Oh, damn. Yeah, it, it, it slogged on. That's like, for sure. Like after <laughs> Stefan and uh, I think Caroline. That's where I'm at. Yeah, oh. I, I stopped after that. Because Elena right here. I have no idea what they're talking about. She's Marito. <laughs> I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to tell her she should watch The Boys, but... Hey, The it's Boys. It's too gross. It's not I've that seen bad. the first couple so episodes. so good about it, though. Mm. It's raw. Yeah. I told her there's lots of drama in it. She would like it. Yeah, she would. I don't like drama. I like soft comedy. Did you watch Bridgerton? I love Bridgerton. I hate Bridgerton. <laughs> Season two was bad. Season one was good. Season two is so bad. Season two was bad, I will admit. Season one was meh. Okay, I didn't, I didn't understand why I was watching it. I didn't understand I was watching it. I just I don't know. Okay, my only thing with Bridgerton is that I thought it was more like Pride and Prejudice, like PG, because I didn't read the books, and I watched it with my parents. <laughs> it's 1800s Gossip Girl. It was just like all sex. Yeah. <laughs> she just said, that's it. It was good. I don't know. I mean, I get mixed reviews. So. It caters watching. to a different audience, yeah. I think. The last the thing more, I, uh, I saw was The Great. Have you seen that one? The what? The Great on Hulu. It's uh, Queen Elizabeth from uh, Russia, and uh, oh. Pe- and Peter the Great. Isn't that um, <laughs> Elle Fanning and Dakota Fanning? Uh, it's uh, Elle Fanning and uh, Nicholas Holt. Yeah, from X Men First yeah. Class. Uh, he's uh, Hank. Yeah, he's the one with the hand feet. He's blue. Beast. Yeah. Yeah. Jesus. I like it, dude. Oh, Danny, you would like uh, fucking. You keep Peter saying I. Would, you guys keep saying I would. I would like everything. No, no, that's not true. You know what you'd really like though? Really, really, really like Prince of Tennis. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> so you are recommending no, it? No, no, no. I ain't never seen that shit in my life, dude. I ain't never seen that. So, shit. so uh, why, why do you think he? Dude, like I it? tune in <laughs> like. A, 3 a.m. I think. Dude, to why are you up on like Saturday? <laughs> and he's talking about Prince of Tennis. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, perfect timing. No, because <laughs> Dollar Coins was bringing it up. He was like, so have coins, you actually dude. seen Prince of Tennis? I was like, no, I've never seen Prince of Tennis. I've never. The first <laughs> anime of that anything to do with sports I've ever watched is Haikyuu. Before I watched it, like the play. Or anything? Never watched any of that other shit. And hi, to be fair, Dollar Coins it gave me the synopsis, and it sounds pretty good. So, but I've never seen Did, goddamn. Didn't Prince they just remake it or something like that? I don't know. I don't know. I was saying I've not seen it, so I don't know where this is coming from. But apparently, it's about a tennis player who gets kicked off like the Japanese team, so he goes to America and joins their team, and then stomps them. Makes sense. So that sounded pretty good to me. So I was like, oh, okay, cool. That sounds amazing. But. I've never seen that show in my <laughs> fucking life, dog. I've seen a Prince of Tennis. <laughs> Maybe it was Matthew. That seems something up his alley, you know, watching Zatch Bell and stuff. Yeah. He loves Zatch Bell, too. Yeah. Me, me and Matthew love Zatch Bell. There's yeah. nothing wrong with Zatch yeah. Bell. I yeah, just don't remember it. it. Yeah. it good. Do you, did you do Card Captor Sakura? Did that ring any bells to you? I remember it was on the CW way back when I was a little kid. Yeah. And I would come home and I was like, what the fuck is this? I mean, well, if you guys were little kids, I probably wasn't born. Well, she likes Sailor Moon. And Sailor Moon and I feel like Sailor Moon and Card Captor 
card Sakura. after Sakura? Is that the actual yeah, name? Card, card that like runs like hand in hand. Like people really liking that. Yeah. You know, she does this or in high school club. So is it, does she watch it? <laughs> I watched it in high school. I was in anime club. You were in the anime club in high school. Yeah, and Quidditch. And Quidditch. We were in the same group. So if you're in Quidditch, you have to be in anime club. What, what house? What house are you in? I'm a Hufflepuff. Are you? Just like Sam. Hmm. No, he's I such a Hufflepuff. Griffin Don't Dora. lie. I'm not. You're go- not brave. I can't be Hufflepuff because I'm not good at finding things. So yeah. I can't be Hufflepuff. At finding things, you do escape. That's their strong. Time. That's their strong suit. Hufflepuff's strong suit is finding things. <laughs> You're just a shitty Hufflepuff. <laughs> <then>. <laughs> yeah, Puff Daddy. She's really good at finding things. Have we done an escape room together? Uh-uh. The only one that she's done was with Chris, Chris. and Melissa. <laughs> and they were high out of their minds. So it was terrible. Yes. <laughs> uh, uh, Sam, you got to do a scary one with her. We she did it with die. the Barnes and Noble people and Josh. Down. Oh, that's true. That's true. I've that's done true. two escape rooms. The one we did with Barnes and Noble was really shitty. And the one that we did with Chris was not the best one. But it was from the guys that we did the butcher with. It was their other escape room. The Area oh, 51 the Area 51. One. Yeah. yeah, I remember. We did that one. And I was pretty disappointed with that one because the, the butcher one was so good the butcher one Whereas, was like funny. the area 51 one was like oh this is really not like not the best like it's i i would wager that was their first escape room that they that they made and they oh that makes sense that. and it just did like a decent amount so they're like okay let's invest yeah. in this now yeah it was like, good though it was like two rooms you know it's like very basic yeah, butcher we barely was, what, got three to that rooms? second yeah. one yeah yeah, I, I want to do one. We should do one sometime. Yeah, I think we're due for one. Yeah, we it's are been due a, for one. It's yeah. been yeah. Last Ruby one we did initiation. was like right before Matthew left. Yeah. So yeah. over a year yeah. ago then. Yeah, it's been a long time. So yeah, cause ain't it, gonna be scary. I always pick them. So yeah, we we fucked ain't up and we let him. Ain't gonna be scary. It's gonna be what it is. <laughs> it's gonna as be long what as it is. it's not in he, L.A. So one of these motherfuckers. He. He picked Zoe. Yeah. And he didn't tell any of well, us no, about no. Here, it. Here's what happened. I think Sam was like, you pick first. I was like, okay, cool. So I found the magician one. I'm like, let's do this one. It looks super cool and simple. It was just, it was fun. Very nice and whimsical. And then I let Sam pick and immediately goes, he picks the scariest fucking thing in all of Orange County and Hell stuff. No. And I'm like, Jesus. Live fuck. actor. Live no. actor. <laughs> I will just start sobbing. It was a great time. It, Don't no, get no, me no. wrong. <laughs> Dude, if I the, shit my pants, but it was a great we, time. We walked in and the jig was immediately <laughs> up because... You, they make you wait outside. They don't mm-hmm. even let you come inside until like the, the group is like completely cleared out. But all you hear is screaming. Yep. <laughs> just <laughs> all like, oh, you hear is <gasps> Like this isn't scary. Nah, 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 Not nah. At all. And then you walk in and it's like, yo, it's dark, whatever. But then they make you sign waivers, like all kinds of waivers. Yeah, from like the you get a heart attack, like, anything. Yeah. And they, did they, did they blindfold our, us? Yeah, they blindfolded yeah. us and had us yeah. walk in. I think uh, yeah. arms and shoulders yeah. and stuff. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> but no, no. So it's like it's cool. It's like a stereotypical creepy house. Yeah. You know, you're, you're cool. Uh, and then the game begins. Yep. I don't want to spoil too much. It was so good. You can spoil it because I'm not doing it. No, it was no, so good. You won't know. You. you It'll be know. fun. We go do it. Me, Katie. I'll take her parents. It'll be like, oh, yeah. Sam. They you, will cry. <laughs> <laughs> Sam, do you remember what you can do? Yeah, 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 yeah. I got okay. it. I got it. I got it. So he knows everything just so mm. that you guys get it done mm. super quick. Mm-hmm. Whose side are you on, Jose? <laughs> I'm not doing it. You'll be okay. Mm-hmm. Trust me. I'm it, great at picking escape rooms. You will have to drag me. It was such a great experience. It you was. Know, it Thank you. Yeah, Even though it was scary, it's like one of my favorites. And we let mm-hmm. Danny be in charge of the key every time. I opened the yeah. door. The, <laughs> the butcher is also very funny to me because we had Chris. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Also, and Matthew. The iconic moments. Yeah. Yeah. Iconic. <laughs> Guys, I can't get out of here. What the <laughs> fuck am I supposed to do? <laughs> 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 just like it's like who wants to go off by themselves? Oh me, me, me! <laughs> and then he winds up in a cage. What the fuck? <laughs> that wasn't even fun. I was stuck in there for fifteen minutes. Yeah. And then uh, the, by obviously iconic Matthew leaving L to die. Just <laughs> oh <laughs> my god. Ah, we were the best ones. Poor we were L. we were in a cell mm-hmm. the whole time, Jeez. minding our own business. I mean, we were kind of retarded, but you know. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm not reaching my hand through that window. That's bullshit. <laughs> yeah, <no. laughs> yep. That is bullshit. I like how we're like, oh, there's keys right there. Who's going to do it this I'm time? I'm not doing it. We've all, in every escape room we've done, we've each I stuck our hands it. in something. <laughs> yeah, I'm not doing it. No, no. Try, like, I think the first one, I think it was the one we did with Andy, when Andy came back. And you guys had me stick my hand in a, like, a mouse oh, hole. Oh, yeah. And the guy grabbed my hand right when I was like. Do you know, like in the mummy in where they make you put your hand inside the hole and you don't know what's in there? In the movie? Yeah, I'm not doing yeah. it. There was a part like that in the first scary scene no, we did. No. Yeah, he scared the shit out of me, and I'm like, wait, let me go back in there. Yeah. 
And then in uh, Zoe, at the very end, they tell you only one person can go. So you walk out, and it's just like immediately like, all right, only one person is allowed to go. And it's like, okay. <laughs> yeah, they straight up say, you must sacrifice one person. Mm-hmm. I did that. I'd so. sacrifice you too. <laughs> that is toxic. <laughs> oh, Dini, have you watched The Boys season three? I have not. Is it done? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's all out. They uh, are. Yeah, the whole thing's three? done. Yeah. They, they released all the same time. I thought you watched it. No, no, I haven't started yet. Haven't okay, so let me, let's each give a review because we've both seen it. So I will go first. It was good. Okay, now you go. I haven't seen The Boys. What did I say? The Boys? The yeah, Boys. you said The Boys. Okay, sorry. Umbrella Academy. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. Season- I've seen Umbrella Academy. Okay, 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 Jesus. Okay. Season, okay, season three review. Danny, go ahead. Allison's a bitch. <laughs> That's for sure. She's a fucking cunt. Have you seen it? <laughs> no, nah, but I probably won't get to okay, it. Okay, have you seen the two after credit scenes? There's two. Two after credits. The one with Ben? There's only one. There's the one with Ben, yeah. The one with uh, Ben? Yeah. Yeah, there's only one. Yeah, that's stupid. Yeah. What am I supposed to learn for that? He likes um, going on train rides? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I just didn't really get, like, he, he started enjoying life more, maybe? I don't know. He was just So sitting. I've seen a couple things. One, I was going to watch a video on what that Ben's scene meant, and I, I yeah. never got around to it. I saw another thing where people are thinking that Allison is dead. Which thank finger, God fingers crossed. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> because I guess the uh, Umbrella Academy like Instagram or something was pumping up the season saying like, one of them is not going to make it like one of them is going to die this season. And obviously, you know, spoiler alert, nobody did. Um, so fingers crossed that was Allison and she just died by pressing the button. Yeah. You know? um, I thought it, the first half was really, really good. Mm-hmm. And then it really fell in oh, the back. Slow half. let down like really fell because the first two seasons were super solid, super, super solid. Mm-hmm. And I felt like it just dragged it big time dragged at the back end of the season. Real hardcore. Yeah. I enjoyed the interaction between like the Sparrow Academy. Yes. And, yes. Like, you know, Umbrella Academy yes. just constantly going at it. But that's, I think one cool. of the best characters of the Sparrow Academy was the black guy, the number one. And they Marcus. kill him instantly. Yeah. They kill him instantly. Marcus. And then everybody else is a little bit less, inter- less interesting. And then they kill off half of them. And it's like, Damn. Oh, okay. And then leave the boring girl. Yep. Whose Little only boring. skill is being attractive. She could levitate people. When she actually use it, because I think she tries to like sneak in Luther. What? She's the slut. Do you hate women? Yes, she does. We've all proven right. that time and time again. <laughs> They're all right. <laughs> <laughs> well, Luther finally, you know, found love. What is love? Thank God it wasn't with Allison. Thank God. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> Awesome, I forced that. Uh huh. <laughs> Rapist. <laughs> <laughs> so I read like they were just um, they're like in a simul simulation right now. Oh really? Yeah. Someone's like they're rising like they're that button resets everything and like they're now in a simulation that uh, Hargreaves built and that's what he was doing. Like he was like, you know how he's like messing around on the yeah. the console and everything. That's yeah. what he's doing, like creating everything. Right there. And so, so is the world still dead and now they're in a simulation or that's I don't know. That's, oh, that's okay. what I heard. But who's that woman with him, the dad who was on the moon, what Luther was guarding? I think that was his wife. But she looked old. But I thought his wife died. Wait, is, is the thing. wife different from the mom? No, that is the wife. You know, like but the I mom's a in... robot. Yeah, yeah but the mom's a robot. That's the different. mom's a robot that was yeah. modeled after his wife. Yeah. Yeah. But she looks old on well, the moon. It, there's uh, an episode where, like, Hargreaves is, like, uh, it's, like, back in time, yeah, right? He and the, then he, he releases the, the fireflies and everything. And then he gets the violin from, like, that dying woman. Do you remember that? I don't remember that at all. Yeah, and I that's his wife on another planet because Hargreaves is an alien. I don't want to watch this heads. show anymore. She was fading in and out of existence in like the last <laughs> two episodes. Like she didn't even want to watch it. They saw it. Like she yeah. really <laughs> liked Umbrella Academy and it, the last two episodes of the third season, which should be the best one. She did not even want to watch it. They did lost it. me. Yeah, I feel that. You know, did first you get- two seasons. Great. Great. Mm-hmm. I love Klaus, though. Klaus is OP. Yeah, I gotta say. <laughs> yeah. he, he's super OP. He can. He was good through the whole thing. I think any scene with him is like it's just. It's great. It's I like time. Diego a lot. Diego was really good this season. Really, really good. Huh. 
She hates Diego. Damn. Diego got better, but Diego's also a little bitch. She doesn't like anybody with feelings. Aw. <laughs> Not true. Yeah, that's why she hates Deku. I hate Deku. Because <laughs> he, he, he cries all the time? Deku is a whiner. He's like... He breaks his uh, arm and leg every time he fights. Get he over the it. Right... You'd think he'd get used to it by oh, now. Oh, get over your gimp God. arm. Cut it off. <laughs> Cut off and I will. <laughs> but if you break your arm and leg every time, you'd be in so much pain. At a certain point, wouldn't he build up resistance? Stop crying or stop doing it. He should have given the power to Lamillion. He's trying Lamillion. to be a hero. He's trying to be a hero. He I mean, isn't I, cut out for it. I love Lamillion, so. He should have gotten the power. All Might fucked up choosing Deku. I don't wow. think so. I like Deku. Well, what you don't know, I can't say. <laughs> say it. No. Say it. Don't spoil it. I can't. Spoil don't it. Spoil. I can't. spoil it. No. Spoil. I can't. Spoil. I can't. Spoil. I can't. Spoil. I can't. <laughs> I hate Deku. Don't All right. Me. Do it. Don't do it. Go ahead. No, <laughs> don't tell me. Tell I will me. not move in. <laughs> if, if Danny. This is, this is two pulling forces. <laughs> I'm but. just here. It's okay. You can tell me after. Yes. Yeah, yeah. After. Go ahead. I can say close it now. Doors. No, you cannot. Is I, it because he knows or he doesn't he want to He doesn't know. know. He, because he hasn't I don't read it. Know. It's not that okay. big of a spoiler. I mean, if it's this much fuss. No. Sam, if I did, if the roles were reversed, you'd be like, no, 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 no. You'd be whining about it. He gets bitching. super mad with spoilers. Yeah, I know. <laughs> he hates a girl at Barnes & Noble for that reason. She spoiled one thing, and he'll never forgive her. Is it Attack on Titan? Okay, yes, it yeah, was Yeah, it was Attack on Titan, <laughs> yeah. She also spoiled quintessential quintuplets. So. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I was ever going to watch it. But, <laughs> but you're like, fuck you. <laughs> now for sure you're not going to watch it. Yeah. She's just spoiled the whole ending. Like, who does that? Like, Not you, right? You would never do that. <laughs> Mine he really, he really Mine wants to right now. Mine is just a small no, detail no. and not the ending. Sam, uh, dance around it. You're better. Hits. He's not dancing around nothing. I just, right? I just, I'm he more, has no feet. I want to know what it is. <laughs> no. I don't know what it is. You already know what it is. No, I don't. Innately. Because yeah. he might. Okay, sidebar after the podcast is over. Please. Okay. <laughs> Please. There's no reason for you to tell it right now. I right? could, though. Like, yes, <laughs> you could do a lot of things. You see how he just likes to, like, dangle his power <laughs> in front of you? It's just a tip. Just to keep you on edge. he says you're the toxic one? Yeah, I know. It <laughs> is. Toxic, I just dude. match his energy. No. I'm starting to reevaluate things now. Mm-hmm. I got to be know? toxic to survive him. in this household. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought me, me and Sam were like the non-toxic ones, but I am not. Sam toxic. is so drama. No. I swear to God. <laughs> no way, dude. I'm just vibing, trying to have a good time. He's super ragey. No. Super <laughs> ragey. No. All right. Well, we're done. Unless I could tell my my hair academia. No. Fact. Do it. We're done. All right. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks for watching, guys. I guess we're done. Danny's fault. Yeah. So. We'll see you guys next Wednesday for another podcast. I mean, unless we can do more right now. Uh, oh, he really wants no, to. Look at thanks him. Thanks for watching, guys. <laughs> this is episode 124. Four. Four. Yep, 124. Uh, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Yeah. We'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody. Yeah. On, I mean, unless. No. <laughs> <laughs>